Hello, this is Smarter Prepping with Uncle Mark, and I'm Uncle Mark. Today is Monday, the 29th of January. Monday, the 29th of January, 2024, right? The time is now about 9.34 p.m., okay? And uh, the reason I'm recording this video is I was watching over at Midwest Magic Cleaning, I'm going to go ahead and go go to the other, look at my knees and get this. Over at Midwest Magic Cleaning, this guy has, this guy's name is Mac. He has 423,000 subscribers, so you don't, he don't need your help. But anyway, but I just mentioned, he's real smart, all those subscribers, he does lots and lots and lots of things. He's, he's not stupid, he's a very smart man. But he did something here that's not smart at all. I don't know if you can see this by the, the cam, but he's got this. TV, this big widescreen TV, on its little bitty legs that come with these TVs. See, here's the ones that come with mine. See? See those little legs? See how that looks? You put the, see the TV over there? See? TV's over there, right? So you put the leg over here, put the leg over there, whoop, on either side of it, and put it on a table. Uh, my suggestion, don't ever do that. <laughs> See, this guy's really smart. I'm not saying he's stupid, but he he made a big mistake here. Because small children are a minor earthquake and knocked that over. Okay? Now I'll show you what you do here. Here's Walmart.com. Look at that. See, I worked at Walmart for 12 years. Follow me? I worked at a Walmart for 12 years. And my first when I first started there, I was working at the furniture department. Follow me? And this is what you do. You buy a stand like this. This one's only $98. I might buy, in fact, see, I'm planning to get me one. <sighs> Especially inspired by Mac and his mistake. Because <laughs> he actually bought that stand. He bought that stand for the people. Because he's got pretty good with that many subscribers. He's got disposable income. So you feel sorry for the people. He bought him a nice stand. But then stood the TV on the stand with little bitty legs. Oh, my gosh. So public service announcement. Anybody sees this, I recommend do not do that, okay? You buy a stand like this, you can get ones that look more wood grain cabinet down below, this and that, the other. But you see this, you see how this here, those two uprights, those two uprights, those two vertical pieces, they slap onto the back. I have vertical pieces like that on the back of my TV. And what you do is you, you, you lay, see I take the TV when I get the new one, I take the TV off of that little homemade scrap lumber stand, and I'll lay the TV face down on the bed here, see? Lay the TV face down on the bed. Then I take the two vertical rods that'll come with my new stand, and you mount them to the back. That's what you do. See, you don't want to use these. See, these have little holes in this little, see that slides in like that? See? Don't use those. I, I strongly recommend don't use those. I know of somebody in the extended family who has her TV set up like that, and she had nieces come over, two small children nieces, and she was so worried. That's rightly worried, see? But you see back here, I've got those those two uh, vertical things. You can't see it where we're in the light back here, but there's a vertical. I could actually get my flashlight and kind of show you. But I already have the vertical uh, pieces in there, right? But if I get a stand like this, I'll get new ones. See, I got those pieces. I just had me a, a kit. It's meant to mount to the wall. But it's fitting a mount to the wall, I mounted to this. But you see what I mean going back years? Yeah, see if you can see the Yeah, the vertical pieces. Then in this case hook onto this horizontal piece, the piece that has these wing nets behind here. Okay. But it's through all this, I'll throw out the scrap lumber. When I get a new stand, that will stand here, and I'll mount it to that upright, like the one I showed you in the... See, so that'll be nice. And I already showed you and talked about how I'm going to get two more of those cube units, those lighter colored ones, but one here, one here, right? And then put these two homemade, handmade, thermal bookcases over here, okay? I, I need to continue sorting my... Uh, Food, and I showed you my last recent video. So I need to 
mark best if used by dates on little cards. So as I glance at any of these totes, I can see the best of used by dates on some of these goods. Okay. Gradually get that all done up. It'll be great. Anyway, so I just wanted to show you uh, that little bit, give you public service announcement. Do not, <laughs> Uncle Mark recommends, do not, do not, do not use those legs. Because small children and minor earthquakes can knock the darn thing down, damage the children, damage the TV. Anyway, I'll give it up at this point. Oh, still a rambling all the evening, okay? So, are you ready? Three, two, one. Later, Tater.